Eagles Heads is a small township on the New South Wales south coast. It is approximately two and a half hours drive from Canberra. Chiros is also referred to as the Twin Lakes Resort because of the two large lakes adjacent to it. Chiros Head is so named because it is here that the Chiros River, which rises in the Australian Alps near Nimitabel, flows out into the Tasman Sea. Chiros is famous for its variety of beaches, long open beaches, small secluded ones, but all of them with clear inviting water and miles of golden sand. As one would expect, ocean fishing is very popular here, either from the beaches, the rocky headlands, or off the rocks into the estuaries. Chiros also has a distinctive and rugged coastline. One of the popular spots at Chiros is One Tree Point. And because it has a year-round, even surf, it has become a mecca for surfboard riders. In most early mornings, one can see these skillful people performing their spectacular art on the many beaches at Turos. Most of the time, the surf is peaceful but there are times when it can be rough and treacherous. And the remains of this ship's boilers on the rocks at Bingy Point are testimony to the treacherous seas that can be experienced at Turos Head. But it's the lakes at Turos that are its major attraction. Professional fishermen can often be seen preparing their boats on the boat ramps or moving up the lake following the tides to set their nets. Recreational boaters and fishermen are catered for too. There are two boat sheds which offer either powered or rowing boats for hire. Lake Coiler on the northern side of Chiros offers miles of water space for recreation, kayaking, sailboard riding, sailing, swimming and general recreation. Chiros also offers first class sporting facilities for adults and young people. Cricket is played on a turf wicket a nine-hole golf course, which will test the skills of the best golfers, and a bowling club, which has a number of bowling rinks available, both for locals and for tourists, where competition bowling can be viewed on two days per week. The natives are friendly, but some just a little bit shy. Accommodation is available at Turos as well. There are two caravan parks, one close to the beach and the other on the lake shore further infield. People building permanent residences have a number of choices of location. Some may choose to build in broad acres. Others might opt for suburbia. Others in this perfect bush setting or a blend of all of those, but you'll notice they always take advantage of the spectacular views. Tiros also has a motel, 
which has a restaurant attached. And in addition, there are two other restaurants which cater for the personal choice of visitors and locals alike. At the end of the fishing trip, loading the boat onto the trailer, there are the ever-present pelicans and gulls to relieve you of any leftover fish or fish bait. And at the end of yet another perfect day at Chiros Head, the high boats are safely moored as the sun throws out its last light for the day.